So in this problem, once again, we are factoring polynomial expressions. Uh, our first step is always look for a greatest common factor. We have 5, 15, and 20 for our coefficients. Negative 20, but uh, as far as looking for common, the greatest common factor, 5, 15, and 20. The greatest common factor is 5. And we do have x's in each one, so we know we're going to have a term that factors out. And then x cubed, x squared, and x, the greatest common factor is x. So we'll factor out the 5x first. The greatest common factor, 5x times x squared plus 5x times 3x. And then we know this is going to be minus, and to get... 5x times what equals negative 20x? That's just going to be minus 4. And now we want to know what numbers multiply to negative 4 and add to 3. So we'll look at the factors of negative 4. So we're looking at plus and minus so we'll start with 1 times negative 4, 2 times negative 2, and that, that's the only combinations that we can have with uh, this first part being positive. So we'll look at the negatives now, negative 1 times 4, and negative 2 times 2. Since these are the same, switching them doesn't do anything, so this is basically the same thing. So we're only looking at these three. So we we'll look at the sums, and we have 1 minus 4 is negative 3, 2 minus 2 is 0, that would end up being a conjugate, and then negative 1 plus 4 is 3, that's what we're wanting, we're wanting positive 3, so we know it's going to be x minus 1 times x plus 4. So this equals 5x times x minus 1 times x plus 4. Now to check that, we can just multiply through. So I'll save the, the 5x for last. We'll look at that afterwards. We'll just distribute that. So I'm going to use the FOIL method this time. This is going to be x times x is x squared. Outside would be 4 times x, so plus 4x minus the inside, 1 times x. Negative 1 times x is minus x. And negative 1 times 4, our last terms, is going to be minus 4. So that equals 5x times x squared plus 3x minus 4 and multiplying that back through we end up with 5x cubed plus 15x squared minus 20x which is what we started with so that shows us that this is the factorization of our given polynomial.